Hey everybody, how uh, how's it going? I want to ask. No. In oh fuck! Knowing full well it's not going well. <laughs> hey, uh, Kaiser Christian. Good luck on best game. Thank you. I'm happy to meet other people that really like uh, that really like Five because I'm I've always been a big fan. Hey, Paper Sonic, how's it going? I haven't seen you here in a while. Where is Toad Man? We haven't even gotten to the game yet. I don't even know the men. How's it going, Kim Boyga? The men in this game are, uh, an odd bunch, I will say. Yeah, the Legacy Collection is loud. It, my stream is just always loud because I'm very bad at balancing. I remember saving up for Mega Man 5. Those were the days. Oh man, Dave. Wait, I missed a little bit of the dialogue, I think. Uh, that's awesome. And they are 2000XX or 2020XX. I wish you could get the start to go away. A vicious army of robots is bent on destroying the world! And behind this destruction is... Proto Man? That's not the original text, is it? <laughs> Looks super out of place. That's awesome, Dave. Uh, I didn't play it until the Anniversary Collection, but uh, I, I really like this one. I would say my top three are probably two... No, nah, top four. <sighs> two, nine, three, five. Five is really good, though. But they're, like those are all really good ones. Man, I should practice this game while watching. Please do. You can uh, learn from all my terrible gameplay mistakes. Original font? Nope. So we can game together. Aw. <laughs> it's like a giant fish. Oh man, that's awesome. Ooh, controversial. I put three and four above five. Wow. I didn't realize uh, Dave was so stupid. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> You know, how long, how long has it been since you've played this one? I was thinking about that before I got on stream. I think that I played it with Wayne um, when he visited me in Virginia. So that was probably like... Oh. Time. Seven years ago? Eight, maybe? Man, been a long, longer time than I thought. Uh, anything but Rockman 6. Is that Rockman 6? I like 6 a lot, too. I, w I would put 6 above 4. I'm not a big fan of 4. I think 4 is really bland, to be honest. Um, oh, shit. I'm just, who do I want to start with? Start. Start, man. You're just jealous of Toad Man. This song is not great. I'm going to throw that out there. Is the volume okay now? Turn up a little bit. What I really like about this game, though, is... Wait. Is, uh... All the different stage gimmicks that it has. I think that it, it injects some much-needed, uh... Creativity into the series. Because I think that's what 4 was missing a lot of. Um... Like, for example, this stage... Is a space stage, but it has low gravity. Which I don't think the series never did before and I don't know if they ever did after just kind of weird uh, this part is confusing because you're supposed to go down even though uh, it's just a bad choice um, I should look oh yeah this game so this game is very much very easy compared to the others too which is another reason that I like it um, the mega buster has the biggest charge shot it will ever have and it is super powerful, and uh, it, this game drops one-ups like <laughs> no other. Which I think is great. You better blast Gravity Man. 4 had slapping boss music. It did have good boss music. 
Six has weird slides, it's hard to play, though I speedrun uh, so probably a different experience with casual. Yeah, I don't I don't speedrun anything because I hate it, but uh, I can see that. I haven't played six in longer, so it's I would have to refresh my memory. The stage has underwater physics, actually. Yeah, it does. I think I think that's a cool idea for a space themed stage, because they never did that. Uh before or after, I don't think. Which I think is, uh... I did, I did practice this part earlier, and I did it correctly, but I don't want... <laughs> I don't want to fuck it up now. Leave me alone! That's true. Yeah, and this game has it has a lot of stuff like that where it's like Oh hey, that's a cool idea. Like I don't know, I love the Mega Man games and I think the the gameplay is fine on its own, but it does make it it does make it nice when it's got interesting wrinkles in it. I mean, after after they add the charge shot, which they did in 4, I mean, they stopped adding new like well, this game doesn't really have any new feature features. Like 6 has the uh, super adapters which are very cool in their own right, but this game doesn't have a... Uh, ooh, God. Have anything like that. Which, you know, I think is fine because, like I said, I think that this game does a lot of other really creative things. Huh. It's also just nice to play a Mega Man game that's not brutally difficult. Every time, every time you die, I'll reveal one of your embarrassing secrets. I wonder how many you have. I would watch that. Have you ever seen the speedrun of this game? No, I haven't. I don't watch speedruns very often, but uh, I bet it would be. I bet it would be interesting. They're always. Oh god. They're always pretty interesting. Starman is a. Uh, very easy unless he just decides to fucking jump you repeatedly. I'm surprised I dodged that. I jumped way too early. Does 4 have the thing where you lose your charge if you get hit while you're charging your shot? Okay, buddy. Fuck me. Because this game does. I died on the first stage, so this is going this is going swimmingly. This would be a fun stage for Mario Maker, because you could have the um Would you care to shoot your fucking star shield, you dick? You'd have the uh nighttime and underwater physics. He's got a huge fucking shield. You guys, Fish is secretly terrified of oatmeal. It's not true. I do like oatmeal, although I haven't really had very much oatmeal. Apple cinnamons and brown sugar, I think, is pretty much it. You can skip the refights for free in this game. Probably my favorite thing. I did not know that. I played, I played these games on the Anniversary Collection once, because I had the GameCube version. Oh, you get the Super Air here. Um, and I believe Star is good against Gravity. Um, but I played it on the GameCube, which had the reversed A and B buttons, which was maddening. Oh, Star Man, our hopeless space romantic. <laughs> and then I played them again when they came out on 3DS. Uh, and I played them a fair amount on 3DS, because I... I kind of was speedrunning it then, but it was for no no one's benefit but my own. So this stage is really cool. I mean, I was shocked when I saw this in an NES game. Because I played I played Super Mario Galaxy before I played this game. It's hard for me to get used to not having low gravity now. 
Um, and yeah, it's just, I thought it was really impressive that they pulled that off in an NES game. That background though right there wigs me out a little bit. Oh fuck, everything about the GameCube collection, reverse buttons made all the games unplayable. Uh, I, I struggled through all of them, all eight of them, and the uh, arcade games in that collection because B was jump and you could push Y for rapid fire, which I'm not a huge fan of using rapid fire and in that collection it made it, it got really difficult once you got the charge shot because rapid firing is not as good as using a charge shot. Um, but that was kind of my workaround and eventually I did learn how to play the games that way. So whenever I, if I ever had to play a Mega Man game with a, uh, what the fuck? Oh, please move. With the GameCube controller, I would be fucking so confused. It actually confused me when I moved back to, um... To playing it on anything else. Oh god. Oh my god. <laughs> it's not at all how I meant to do that, but it worked. I don't think I can, yeah. Otherwise that collection was good, you know, other than the uh, almost game-breaking controls. Look at these one-ups. Also, why did that one fall there? What the hell? Who? He was placed on the space station to control Wily's space troops. He tries to romance anyone passing him, but he's a silly robot. I also just like this room, because I can do this. Um, if anyone's interested in more Mega Man content, um, the Hitoshi Ariga manga are really good, and the Archie comics I also really like. They're very different, but they're all good. Now, let me see if I... It's a good latency test. I'm surprised that hit. So he is weak to star. Let's, let's just use it a little bit. Why not? It's wild out on him. What are your thoughts on the 90s cartoon? I honestly don't think I've ever watched a full episode of that. Uh, it's funny. Because uh, when I was when I was dating more in Virginia, uh, one one girl, okay, so one girl I I told I liked Mega Man a lot, and I was like, yeah, I have this like comic book series. There's this comic book series I'm really into because that's when the uh, Archie comics were coming out, and I was like, yeah, it's it's a really it's about this robot, and like he, and she was like, oh yeah, I think I thought I turned this notifications off. She was like, oh yeah, I think I know. Uh, I think I know Mega Man. I was like, oh, cool. And I asked her if she wanted to borrow the comics, and she was like, yeah, sure, that sounds cool. And she read them. The next time we hung out, she was like, all right, I'm going to be honest. I thought you meant Mega Mind. Keep in mind, I went on about Mega Man for, like, probably 30 minutes. Because you know me. I can't. Once I'm talking about something I like, I just don't stop. And I let her borrow the comics, and she thought the entire time I was talking about Mega Mind. I was like, it's this popular game, popular game series from like the '80s and '90s. Um, Mega Mind, yeah, the the movie with the blue alien villain dude. Um, and then another girl I dated in New York um, told her I was into Mega Man, and after the first time we hung out, she went and watched a bunch of episodes of the cartoon because she thought that's where like it came from or something. And she was like, that cartoon's really bad. And I was like, yeah, I didn't tell you to watch it. And she she was like super pissy that like, 
I, I, that I told her I liked the Mega Man, so she watched this cartoon to get closer to me, and I didn't like the cartoon. Oh, man. Yeah, Mega Mind. Yeah, Bullet Dodged, uh, if only. Um, Alright, Gravity is good against... Is it Crystal or Stone? I believe it's Sailor Moon Crystal. Nope, it's Gyro. Um, Legacy Collection sadly has input lag on Switch though, which is a sh which is lame. See, I wondered about that. I have a little bit of latency um, since I'm doing it through my capture card, and I am playing it on the Switch. Um, I've just learned to live with it. I used to be a really big, like, really against any input delay, like, because I play I play a lot of old school games. And, like, I only buy monitors or TVs if they have, like, you know, max, like, four or five milliseconds of input delay. But until I can stream, like, through a CRT with no delay, uh, that's just kind of the world that we live in, unfortunately. There's a lot of problems with this world. I think that you- I don't think you can stand on these guys in this game. You can in one of the Game Boy games, but I don't think you can stand on top of them when they have their shields up in this game. Gy Gyroman goes well with tzatziki sauce. You buy me- uh, you buy me secondary NES, yes. <laughs> By my secondary your secondary uh, explain what you're talking about because I'm not entirely sure you have a second NES that you can stream with I do have my um my NES classic I guess I could be playing them all through that on here if there's I didn't realize there was a more significant delay uh on the switch version than there was just all together otherwise I probably would have been doing that this entire time so maybe, maybe for Mega Man 6, I'll play it on the NES Classic. What do I have that can kill these dudes? Why is this shield called Star Crash? Star Crash! Look at these extra lives, dude. It's just shitting them all over me. I wonder if this, these are the same background clouds, foreground clouds, as Mega Man 2. Holy mother! Who? Oh god. I just remembered my other NES is pal. <laughs> yeah, I'd love to get some solution to be able to play uh, other systems on stream, I just don't have one right now. The only thing I have is this capture card that is HDMI, oh, this fucking part, I forgot about this. It's HDMI only. Um, fuck. But you can have a Super Famicom. If you're willing to part with the Super... I've always wanted a Super Famicom. I, I love the controllers, and I honestly don't like the Super Nintendo design that we got that much. Oh my god! Okay. Forgot how to do this part. Elgato. Yeah, Elgato. I, I was like, how many lives do I have? I'm probably almost out. Fucking five more. Goodbye. Let's just use this. Be gone! Oh shit. Oh god. One of these. <laughs> oh my fuck. Oh. <laughs> Thought that was a wall. 
I keep feeling like enemies are gonna jump out of everything, because that's how, like, even 4 was. Like, there should be an enemy jumping out of there. Like, I complained a lot about the... the boringness of 4. It was more difficult than this game, but, like, I think this game just has more engaging level design, maybe? I'll try him first without it. You guys, when Fish was 8, they forgot his gym shorts in gym class and had to wear frilly pantaloons. That one's true. No, I did have to, uh... I did have to wear the rental shorts a few times in high school. Uh, because I, I would forget mine. Honestly, I just, I really hated wearing mine because... I really didn't care when we bought them. I just wanted to be out of there because I... Teenager. And, uh... Oh, you are not difficult, are you? And, uh, so I ended up getting mine, because you had to get them, like, not engraved, but, like, personalized with your first name on here, and then your last name on your shorts. And my shorts were super short. And, uh, like, my shirt was really big and baggy, so it almost looked like I wasn't wearing shorts. And that was around the time when, like, uh, long shorts came more into style. Like, shorts that went past your knees. At least, the first time I was really aware of it. And, uh... Yeah, it was humiliating to wear those. Uh, when Fish exercises too much, he smells like sandalwood and the ladies want to smooch all up on him. That's not true, because I don't exercise. <laughs> Uh, I use the Elgato Game Capture HD, which lets me record anything that runs NES, SNES, GameCube, PS... Wow. I might have to look into that. Ky Kaiser Christer? That sounds that sounds really cool. So it, ha it has all those inputs? Rental shorts are foul. They were. They smelled bad like... This is middle school, so not even teenage boys. Like... Pr uh... The hell are they called? Not tween. It's, tween's not the word I wanted. Prepubescent boys. They smelled bad, but uh, there was one pair that was uh, long enough for me. Because I was, I was really short, too. And uh, every once in a while, I would just, like, I would get to wear those. I think one time they let me wear just my regular pants, too. I also have the Robot Master Field Guide somewhere that has all the weaknesses in it, but I know they're updating that. I hope and doubt they're updating it with the, uh, oh god. With the weaknesses from, um, Rockman Worlds. Because that would be, that would be cool. That was one thing I always hated about that field guide. They had the weaknesses for just the NES games. It was like, I would love to see the weaknesses for, you know, the arcade games and, like, uh, especially Rock the Game Boy games. Oh god, this- so, okay. Kaiser, can you tell me something here? Is there a trick to this part? Like, just getting through it quickly and easily? Because this is always what I've done. Is I've always just waited for one to drop and then I've pulled this out. Because it seems like they just fall randomly, right? What? I don't know how that didn't hit me. Use star. Okay. Yeah, that's what I assumed, but... See, I never... I also am just... Looks like a bombable wall. Man, it's been a long time since I played this game. Wait, how many stages have I done? One, two, three. Okay, and I have all the letters. Okay. Just making sure I'm not missing any. HDMI, composite, etc. It locks to 30 FPS, though. But there are some ways forcing 60, but I don't know. It doesn't affect runs, so nothing noticeable. I'm gonna have to look into that. Oh, what up, Tom? How's it going? Have you been watching since the beginning? You played this one already, though. I don't need to ask you if you've seen it. Um, Kaiser, if you want to join our Discord group or add me on Discord, I would I would love to... Because uh, I, I will 1,000% forget after this stream. Man, I really like the aesthetic on this stage, too. Like, Jewel Man stage... I'm gonna say, it doesn't really have anything on this stage. Okay, 
let's just let's just kill this dude first. Gravity you away. You be gone. No. It's worth a shot. God, I hate this menu. I I have never liked the menu. Like, the menus in Mega Man games for choosing weapons are just terrible. I'm I'm gonna say it. It's hard to see where you are because it just illuminates it with color when you're over it. And the actual directional control of the menus is bad. Look at this, look at this ground I'm standing on though. Look at those colors, man. Beautiful. Just jumping in now, all right. How, how, uh, how's your day been? I'm trying to think of like the best way to ask that because I know no one's doing particularly well. He almost got me. <laughs> what the fuck? Ah! Need that M tank. How does a rush jet in this game work? I forget. I think it. Okay, you can still go up and down with it. Shit. I can just rewind. Like it doesn't really matter. I want I want the I want the thing though. So I'm going back for it. Rewind. I'm just gonna die. Uh you can use arrows from the staircase where you came from and ride it over the crystal spawn when their spawn points comes on screen, which is the perfect setup if you want to do this do this at oh, the arrow thingy. Gotcha. We're double stuck at home today, so that's interesting. Alright, if I don't get it this time, I will probably just rewind. Oh shit, what? Wait, is this... Am I... No, I'm not past it. Okay. I thought maybe I'd gone... I had hit another checkpoint that was beyond the, uh, the V. It's not a V in Mega Man. Vega Man. Where would you put a V in Mega Man if you could put a V in Mega Man? You guys, Fish once spent two weeks learning all the words to Funky Cold Medina. It's true. Bad thing is, I listened to a... Oh my god, okay. I listened to a... Come on, ride the train the week after and I forget all the lyrics. I appreciate... I like these facts. I would like you to die to give me health, but I don't think you're going to. He's weak to a hero. But since I have an abundance of lives, I might as well just see if we can, if we can mega blast him. lot to keep track of in this fight. Yeah. Crystal Man. I haven't been saying any puns when I kill him. Uh, I, I left him seeing stars. I guess he didn't understand the gravity of the situation and uh, whatever Dave said about gyro sandwiches.
Gyrocopter is an interesting power because you shoot it and then you can push up to make it go up. Not a lot of powers have like that usability this early on. Oh, you run the game on turbo? Not sure what, what you mean by that. Fish wanted to be a plumber for many years, uh, but couldn't due to a debilitating poop phobia. That's, uh, that's not true. Had a very bad uh, poop experience like a year ago. You can change the CPU speed to original or turbo and pause menu for many of the legacy collection stuff. What's the difference? Gyro to fucking... Uh, or no, crystal. Crystal to napalm. Yeah. Never would have figured these out. I like these trees. Dr. Wiley does sure like making robotic animals. Basically, NES lag or no lag. So, turbos no lag and... Oh, interesting. See, I love the Mega Buster in this game because it just it rewards you so much for charging it up. And also it's it's a very easy to not have the sound for it playing the entire time. Ah, uh, yes. Robo furry. <laughs> he makes all sorts of animals though. fucking thing. These are no replacement for scrubbing bubbles. Fuck. Can I make gyro with gyro attack? Sorry. Oh, I can make it go down. Alright. Fuck it. <laughs> oh shit. want to see. Okay. Like, when it decided what to give me. Yeah, I saw when Crystal Man weapon popped out because it got... because it lags at the screen. I saw it when Crystal Man weapon popped out because it lags the screen because four plus enemies. It doesn't matter, by the way, I'm just mumbling to myself. Interesting. Yeah, that, that is interesting. I uh, hadn't really thought about it, in, surprisingly, in all my time playing through uh, 1 through 4. God, would you t hit him in the head? Would you do it right? He's laughing. You're laughing. You, sh you hit me with a rocket and you're laughing. Oh my god, I cannot fucking hit him. Oh my fuck. One of those enemies that just, if you're not careful, can just really fuck you. Oh fuck. God damn it. I do like that I can just get rid of his missiles entirely if I just leave the fucking screen that he's on. Oh, cool. I don't like that, though. Be gone. Nope. Mm. 
It's not even, like, hidden or hard to get to. It's just... Would you like to spend three more seconds getting this one up? Oh. Okay. Oh my Christ. Set him by go in and out of the room as well. I think it has to do with pixel and timing frame. He drops the item. Yeah, I think so. Uh, I refuse to believe the moon exists. That's true. Welcome to RM5. See, I would assume Napalm Man is weak to wave thing. And I do not remember your moves at all. Okay, there they are. Okay. That went well. Hit me with another fact about me, Dave. I like Napalm Man's sprite, too. It's... it's... good. Soviet spy during cold, the Cold War, and I regret it to this day. Where, are you just coming up with these on the fly? Your improv skills. Flex them. stones and then you put a stone on the railroad tracks to s knock the train over oh yeah these little little metars hang on what what is this? I'm just gonna check. Nope. <laughs> what? What is the point of this? You gotta come up with some kind of mnemonic. Oh my god. I was like, man, it seems something familiar. Do I have all of them so far? I think so. Man, that was uh, fortuitous. I was like, man, isn't there isn't there some weird shit in this stage? Because six six is where it gets even weirder, where it's like you have to have a certain power to break through a spot in the stage to get a to get a thing. There's that one part with the four one ups. Suicides don't count. <laughs> oh my god. What's your uh, what's your best time in this game? Uh Kaiser. Hang on. 
Now I'm suspicious of every wall. Now you got all you need here now. Currently 38-14. Well, prepare to see that get, uh, not beaten by me. Pretty sure I'm already at over, like, about 38 minutes in this game. If you guys want to see someone play this game well, you should watch him do it. Or watch Kaiser do it, I'm sorry. No, be gone. blocks look different. And I remember something about this part, I just don't remember what. But yeah, and Rush Coil's all weird in this game, too. There we go. Is this a different red? I've tried to improve my time the last weeks though so I can focus on Pokemon Stadium runs been getting runs near the 36 mark. Nice! I don't really need this E-Tank, I'm just gonna leave it. Look at you. Look at you with nothing I can use. So Dave, do you know this game really well too? Which, which Mega Man games have you played again, Dave? Except Game Boy games. Did you play Mega Man Game Boy 2? I oh yeah, I was talking about that a couple. Uh, I think last month when I played a Mega Man game. Yeah, I played all the Mega Man Game Boy games. Mega Man 5 is dope. The rest of them are fine. I like the Mega Man Killers as characters and as bosses. I think they're cool. Blade's my favorite. Uh, well, played the first one before you were born. Only four bosses, right? No, there's four from Mega Man 1, and then after you beat those, you get four from Mega Man 2. And they continue that train all the way through until you get to five, which is just the star droids, which are all based on different planets and the sun. They also introduced a lot of neat characters like Punk, Anchor, Belayed, and Quint. And I love Quint. Stupid, stupid as he is for being... <laughs> for being what he is. Should try hitting this guy. Oh, does he not shake the ground? Oh, let's make this way easier. I say as I proceed to not hit any more shots. Oh my god. Get- okay. Do 
You got 2022 in Mega Man Game Boy 2. Only ran it because a tournament. That game has awful music. Have you? Did you see the thing recently about the uh, composer coming out and saying that it was due to a bad uh, conversion? Which I, everyone assumed forever, but like... It was nice to have it confirmed that he wasn't just insane. Has Dave done a marathon of 1 through 6? In real life, maybe on a sleepover years ago on the actual NES. I haven't even done a marathon. I did think about doing that for the stream, but I would want to practice up a little bit, because these games take me about an hour-ish to beat each, and that would be a, a bit of a stream. He might still be insane. <laughs> I did it four weeks ago on a real NES, got four hours, 26 minutes, 24 seconds. See, I, w I would need to re-familiarize myself, with, which is kind of what I'm doing, but um, it's just been so long since I played these that uh, I don't have much confidence in myself. And like, I, I want to go back and just play them all and, and do that, because I think that'd be fun, but... Uh, there's just, there's so much, so many games to play. And I have, I have, I have played these games to death. I know it might not look like it, but... I really wish that I had, like, been able to stream back when they came out on 3DS, because I, I was, I was pretty good at them. I, I had restore points at all of the, um, Robot Master re rematch rooms, and I would go through and, uh, tr I did a no-hit... Or I did a no-death run um, through all of the games. That, oh god, these chickens jump so high. These eggs. These zygotes. Okay. Okay. Oh no. Give me some health, my dude, my chicken. One. One! just disappeared. But I do like this stage. This stage has a lot of charm too, I think. Just the train theme and, you know, you go into the train, you go out of the train, you hear the train on the tracks. I don't give you any health for the entire stage, love that mechanic. Oh man. Uh, the music I sent that bad, uh, the music isn't that bad. Uh, I think the music's pretty bad. Have you heard, um... Rushjet 1's re, uh, remix of that album, because it's really good. Mega Man is addicting, yo. Six hours of six, six different Mega Man games would be a bit of a stream, says the man that made his viewers watch five hours of him playing a virtual boy. I didn't make anybody. Sounds like fun, 767. Uh, it wasn't, because they couldn't see any of the gameplay. I just played it while they just watched. 
If you want, I can teach you refight skip today. One! Choo choo. Oh yeah, def. Uh, maybe. It would be it would be interesting to see how to do it. So when I get there, feel free to uh to point out. I'm definitely gonna die here. Death by train. Ooh, he's about to turn me into a penny. Didn't even run me over. The hell is he weak to again? Stone. Oh yeah, because it's hard to hit him with. Power stone. Power stone. <laughs> you guys, fish won that cup hat shirt. He's wearing it. God damn it! Gotta use it like right on him. Oh, I hate the I hate the shields. I hate the attacks that take forever to come out because you gotta wait for him to be over to shoot it again. Fuck! Fucking what? Oh my god! Oh my fuck! This dude's gonna kill me again. Okay, we're ju we're just gonna die. I'll fix. Fish one that cut that shirt he's wearing from a Barack o from Barack of Barack Obama and a bare knuckle boxing match. I do not think I could beat Barack Obama in a bare knuckle boxing match. Fish <laughs> you guys fish once got killed by a train. In my hometown that would be uh not that hard. Okay. <sighs> Love that RNG of just those being able to appear wherever you are. Are you gonna get out of my ass? Oh wait, can I just pause to make those disappear? That's a neat trick. Oh! <laughs> you can reset stone by going in and out of the menu. I, I just learned, thank you. I try to not do any, like, little tricks like that most of the time, but also fuck that dude. Charge Kick is one of my more liked abilities, because it's... Man, I'm trying to think if there's any other abilities that apply to the, uh, sliding animation. Am I only missing one? Oh, I'm only missing E. Oh, also... It's really, it's good on the stage too. Okay. Because you can get through those without getting hit. I always fuck this part up. You know what? No. I usually do the stage pretty early on. I don't remember how Super Arrow works. Holy fucking shit. Ah, okay. Exactly how I thought I did. Nope. Man, it's really fast though. Because even if you land on top of one of those pipes, it will probably just suck you up into it. What is this, Sonic the Hedgehog? Oh, I forgot I still had that out. Oops. So this part, I played Mega Man 9 before I played Mega Man 5, and this part, um, this part's straight up in Splash Woman stage. Like, I pretty much, it might be exactly copied and, might be exactly copied and pasted over, and, uh, it confused me for a while. Man, 9 does reuse a little too much. I love it, but you can't just go taking parts from other games. Make all your own shit. I think if I even equip a different power here, it'll de-equip it, right? Yeah. This is one of my other liked parts of this stage, is, uh... 
the skidoo part. Skidoo. It's really fun on the anniversary collection because you have the rapid fire, which is really good in this part. this all wrong. Shoot me. Can I share a cool trick from here from this stage, Mr. Streamer? I gotta- oh shit, I can't pause on this part. I gotta highlight. Mega Man, get car. Yeah, feel free to share any- any tricks you want. Oh shit. The whole not pausing thing really fucked me up. <laughs> I don't think I can rewind to go back and do this part again right now if you wanted to show me something on stream, but... Whew! It's like if I miss the letter, I'll be able to do it. Let me see this real quick. It says it's not available? Did you link it from like a personal link? Because it's not even showing it as like one of your clips, it's just showing it as a clip. From now on I will only be referred to as Mr. Streamer. It's not working for me. Other people are welcome to tell, say if it if it works for them. Uh, I hate the ones that can just jump. That I hate. I hate when robot masters jump. Like it seems like that's their best ability. They can have whatever gun they want. They can stop time. If they can fucking jump across the stage, it's fucking. They are fucking gods. Yeah, I like charge kick. I did want Mega Man's um. His kick and smash to be uh, charge kick, but I also don't like how you kick through the water geysers in the stage, but the, it doesn't work with this ability against the actual boss. You guys, fish once flew all the way to Japan just to tell Shigeru Miyamoto that his shirt was inside out. That's that's true. I watched the Nintendo Direct. I was like, that guy's shirt's inside out. I know this is pre-recorded, but I'm gonna fly all the way there with all my money. You got Water Wave. Boop, boop, boop. Oh my god, it's Portor Man. Look at that castle. Proto Man got really narcissistic. <laughs> it would be cool if it was a skull Proto Man castle, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, this purple. Man, I like the I like the color palettes in this game. I don't care if they complement each other or not. I just I like I like when NES games surprise you with like color combinations you weren't expecting and that's just the entirety of that stage. Like Pac-Man Ms. Pac-Man does it really well. Um and I think that uh 6 does it even better than this game. Okay, purple time. Purple Palace. Does anyone remember Purple Palace anymore? Like, I've been asking people this for fucking years. They're always like, what the hell is Purple Palace? I don't love this song. There's something about notes of a certain frequency that just irk me. 
That's it's almost there. It's it's it irks me, but it's not like bad. I can stick around for one more death, then it's then it's a good time. It'll be good once I'm not watching you anymore, fish. <laughs> I know what you meant, but oh man. It's good time. Please leave. Food time. Yeah, I do. Have a good food, Dave. I haven't died yet. Let's see this. What the shit? That's interesting. I must also ask, what the hell was Purple Palace? Uh, Purple Palace was... What, what am I even doing in this game? That's right. It was a... Uh, I believe it first came packed with... Uh, oh, shit. With Windows Vista? Okay, get down here, you dog. Accidentally died, though. Yeah. Oh, shit. No! I can't jump. I, I hate that. If, if you're in him, when you jump, he just jumps with you. I'm starting to think he's stupid. It's much easier. I don't know why I didn't do that the entire time. Oh, my God. Carpet bombing me. Fuck. Why aren't the wheels? Okay, I thought they just weren't working for me. I was confused. Did your sub run out or something? Yeah, it was a game that came packed with uh, Windows Vista, and it was just, like, a bunch of collections of games for, like, really young children. But there were a lot of times where I was without internet when I had Windows Vista, and... Yeah, this is disappearing blocks, right? I cannot believe this is the first time you encounter these in this fucking game. This is, uh, this is a big one. I don't think there's a way to, like, just get past it, either. Why is this so many steps? Okay. I'm like, I can't die because then Dave will leave. Oh, shit. What? Oh my god, that's such a long pattern. Their channel points thing, so probably. Oh good, my fave. Reset room and fly over with arrows or jets. What the disappearing block room? You guys fish once punched out punched out a nun for telling him to cut his hair. It's true. I'm very I'm a very violent person. Oh my god. I've never been in a fight. I was like, is this dude gonna fucking kill me for real? See ya, Dave. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for all the uh, factoids. Yeah, see, I, I don't think I can fly over it. I think that I'll get, I'll run into one and I'll get pushed off. Oh my god, this 
dude. I never finished. Uh, when I did Buster only, I had to learn those, though. I just think I'll get pushed off. Yeah, but I, I don't remember what the actual minigames are. I think there's three minigames in Purple Palace. I'm sure there are YouTube videos. I remember, like, feeling like I shouldn't play it because it was, like, for little baby kids. And I was... What the fuck happened there? Hang on. Like, I hit my head on it or something. You finally got forced onto the new Twitter and you fucking hate it. I didn't even know there was a new Twitter to hate. See? Oh, it fucking... It pulled, see, it's exactly what I was afraid of. I'm just rewinding this part, because that did not work for me. <laughs> Gee, oh, what? You dropped fucking so fast! It's like you make him in one drop off a platform. Oh, look at that. That's all I had to do. Looks like mobile Twitter and it's terrible. Ugh. What? Oh. About these dudes. Goodbye. It had a cake match and find the clothes the thing was wearing. Purple Palace. Thank you. You guys, fish is cheating. <laughs> I mean, I have so many extra lives, I, there's no way I'm gonna game over. I would have three lives now. If I get below three lives, you can call me out. They've disabled the Legacy version today, so you'll be seeing it soon enough. Nah, he's playing smart. I just don't want to waste everyone's time more. Oh god. Let's see week two. Slide right into him. Okay. Fucking one health. This boss. It, like, shoots faster when it gets hit by you? And it aims? He won't get out of my asshole! Holy shit! You guys, Fish hasn't been doing puns. Is that a spelunker? I don't remember what his weakness is either. I know they're all weak to beat, but I want to say it's water. It is. Just gonna do that. Fuck it. What? Did that block the shots? Out of my butthole! No! Try wave, then after each wave, shoot jump the opposite way. To direct his shot goes over you, he moves faster depending on how much damage you've inflicted. Also, he hits like a truck. Yeah, I, I did realize that. I would try that if I hadn't just finished him off.
Yeah, Kaiser, I don't know if um, we're just far away or what. My delay's usually not too bad, but I suppose today it could be worse. Seems like you always have good comments right <laughs> as I finish something off. Is this train doing in here? There's no tracks for you. Oh my god. Out of here, metal hamburgers. Oh my Christ! I remember something fucky about this part. I just don't remember what. Ah, if you just fall there, you just die. You're seven seconds behind because you're on phone. Oh, makes more sense. Uh, let's see. Oh my god. Ooh. Fuck. Sorry, you're a slow poke at the moment. It's all good. I just feel bad that uh, your your tips are going to waste. I do like that these guys don't shoot as they come near you. That's that's a kindness. Look, look, that's a squirtle. Nyok, 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 nyok. Doesn't have a slow poke emote. Got Cyndaquil and Squirtle, though. Let's just do a, uh... little Star Crashy. Oh my fuck. Wait! <laughs> I, I, I hate the pause that you get from getting energy or life in this game. It is so annoying. And not just in this game, in all of the Mega Man games. It's like, oh, I'm, I'm walking, I need to do this very precision platforming, and it's like, Bang! This room is mankas. <laughs> Christ. I can't get fucking far enough away from them. Just getting hit fucking by everything. Oh my fucking god, are you serious? Jumped right into that one. I'm fucking done here. That's exactly how your last three runs have ended? Oh no. Like getting the getting the power up thing or health. Yeah, it's it's so strange that like that's one thing they're just like <laughs> You're just like, yeah, that's fine. Oh my god. Also, oh, I doubled back a little bit too much. All right, well, I get, I'm game over now. Let me just, I'll just gravity hold when I get to that part. Fuck. Fuck this. I don't remember having that much trouble with this, that part before. I definitely am. Thank you, Paper Sonic. You got me. You, you dragged me. I've been dragged, you caught me. You get a you get a big reward. Yeah, a small drop, the place you just got health on. Yeah. It's it's maddening. I'm a filthy cheater. Ha 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 ha.
I'll waste everybody's time. I won't rewind anything ever again. Okay, so they stop being tangible as soon as you hit the button. Oh, that's much easier. That's fair. That is fair. <gasps> Should probably get coil in case I need it. Don't think I will, but oh my fucking god! Be gone! Why does that do so much damage? I will never like in this series how getting shot doesn't hurt you very much, but touching an enemy fucking eviscerates you. Especially bosses. It's just like, yeah, no, that boss, you touched his shoulder. 10 million damage. This isn't Rockman 4. Oh, goddamn. Let's try Power Stone. Oh, that didn't even kill him. What a fucking shitty ability. Holy cr If it's so inaccurate, it should instantly kill... This fucking tiger should instantly kill these things at least. <sighs> All right, so this is. I do not remember which one this is. CI. He's gonna fucking... Wait, I have... I only have three E-Tanks? I thought I got way more than that. Okay. Sorry, I got a distracting message. Not to be a buzzkill, Power Stone became useless after Charge Man. No, yeah, I, I'm just like, I'm tr I try to find uses for a lot of the powers, even though there's... Okay, buddy. Even though there's not often a good use for them.
he ran all the way to the wall that time. Why can I still move? Yeah, like when I when I played Mega Man 2, I just thought Flash Stopper was pretty useless, and then I found that there's a lot of stuff that you can stop or introduce in unique ways if you use uh, use Flash Stopper. Yeah, experiment with them for new strats. Yeah, it's it's interesting. Why is this the only song in all of these fucking stages? Holy mother! Danny. guys are very <laughs> annoying. I would like to refill here, sir. And just listens to one song all day. I thought there was something like hidden over here. Based off of what Proto Man whistles, I would assume that he has better taste than this. Okay. Did you know that in uh, Rockman 4, Bright Stoppers work for longer if you slide? A sliding stops the in-game timer for. I did not know that. That's super interesting. Rush Jet only uh, uses energy if you are standing on it, so you can just have him out and just keep jumping and you'll use, like, a fraction of the actual amount. Or have him underneath a platform that you're on. I'm glad my knowledge can bring you joy, yes. Me too. There's a secret over here. I think I must be thinking of six, though. Boing. Oh, yes. Did this game or did <laughs> uh, Super Mario World come out first? Oh, get out of here, little hamburger. Not hit him. What? No. Ah! Super Mario World. So they probably stole that. Be gone. End stage. Fuck. Oh my god, it's 
not. It's not ending. Finally. Uh, this is gonna kill me right away anyway. Didn't they put this, uh, this boss into the, um, mobile game, Rockman Dive or whatever recently? Why do I have notifications everywhere? Exactly, but did you know that in Rockman 3 they didn't code in to disable the menu while Rush Buster pellets are on screen, so if you change to another weapon while they're on screen, they take effects from the chosen weapon, pellets then become sniper bullets, and does a lot of damage. I don't think I knew that. <laughs> that is, uh... complex, but, uh... very funny. <laughs> Uh, shit. Is it Gyro? I thought someone just messaged me on Steam to, like, be like, ooh, you have a load of notifications? But it was just Steam telling me there was an update. Be happy to get out of this castle area. Oh, the... Cheerios! Oh, move, you fuck! Shoot him! Shoot him one time! No, we shot him. You wanna say hi? Mobilized by milk. <laughs> Hit me with your milk rings. So this is one of my other favorite parts of this game. I remember getting into this part and just being like, what? And like going to go under there. Like, it's, it's so neat. I just think that part's so cool. All right, now we get to fight uh, Proto Man. Let's do it. Oh my god. Jesus, he's shitting damage on me. Get him, Beat. So Beat is the bird that you get for getting all the letters. There's the boy. What a twist. You've done well, Mega Man. I never expected you to defeat my powerful Dark Man robot. So slow. 
Until now, I have managed to frame Proto Man for my crimes. But now, the real Proto Man has appeared and spoiled my plan. Dr. Light is a captive in my lab. Come if you dare. Ha ha. <laughs> Good burb. Yeah, Beat's very good. I used to hate all the ancillary characters in Mega Man, but they've all grown on me. Other than Otto. Otto sucks eggs. And base. I hate base. Different music, please. Oh, yeah. That's not fair. <laughs> now there's a skull castle. There is. It's a weird looking one. That's fucking... That's fucking stupid. No one can defend that. Oh my god. I get myself recentered. Okay, so he didn't have good music taste because he was a phony. Yeah, that's right. Let's try not let's try not to spoil it. The big plot twist. I remember um I had a theory that the Proto Man the the Proto Men, the band, uh that their story was gonna be loosely based off of Mega Man 5 altogether. Because uh I mean, for one, they're called the Proto Men. And two, it, you know, if they were to do Act 3 as a sequel, you know, Proto Man could return, even though he's hurt. The Proto Man that shows up in Act 1 could be, uh. Dark Man. Oh, fuck me. And he's designed to... Oh, fuck. He's designed to fuck! No, he's designed to, um... Like, make Mega Man lose faith. Okay, buddy. Could you leave? Nobody likes you here. Nobody wants to see you. Posting that on the forums at some point, and oh, it's fucking Dustman stage. And uh, someone was just like, No, you're stupid. I was like, Well, I see why I don't interact with this community anymore. I do hope they find this is just fucking Dustman stage. I do hope they find a way to tie some of the games, some of the is that gonna squish me if I go under here? Some of the uh, classic games in again with the uh, the next album, but if anything, I think they would do an X connection, and I doubt they'll do that. I think it'll mostly be about uh, light, and I think roll will be in it. So I guess I mean that's a connection for sure. destroy one. What the hell? 
What the hell, Bulnosaur? <laughs> so this is where you're supposed to refill on weapons if you need them. And by the way, Beat resets his attack when he, he has reached the XY coordinates of... Shoot, what the hell? I need this. Give me a big weapon. Sets his attack when he's reached the XY coordinates behind you a little over your head. So spazzing out will confuse him moving left and right fast so he won't attack if if he doesn't hit that spot. Interesting. Good to know. I need to refill some of my uh, special guns. And my bird, my bird gun. Does the weapon tank refill all of your weapons? I don't remember. RNG is such shit garbage. One more and I'll leave. Come on. There's an M tank in every stage besides the last one from now if you want to skip grinding. Well, that's all you had to say, brother. Leave me be. This chicken was like, would you please stop murdering my children? Oh my god. My Egbert's from fucking the Garfield and Friends show. <laughs> Wasn't his name Egbert? I really just don't know anything. thing. Yeah, I thought this was a really cool boss, too.
can't get cheeky with more shots. You're done. Watch this after beating this boss. I hope it's from Garfield and Friends. What the fuck? <laughs> That's crazy. I jump. Why did I jump that early? Ooh. Oh my god. Fuck. So why is 5 your favorite, Kaiser? Hey, it's Starman stage, yeah. They took the, uh, it's space physics and- fuck. They took the space physics and put it in an underwater stage. Why is uh, 5 your favorite Mega Man game? Didn't you say it was best game? Oh my god. It's like a super delayed jump. Am I gonna game over here? How many extra lives do I have? Zero! One. <laughs> Just keep killing this enemy until he, uh... Oh wow, it does decide it when you kill them. Does it? That's so hard to tell. Great, I love Mega Man Zero. Oh my god, I just jumped right on that. Oh yeah, it is. I've learned every glitch. I've I've learned and glitch hunt this game for three years. Me and my mom played this together. Why I love it so much. Aww. That's cute. Can't imagine I'm trying to imagine like my mom and I play a Mega Man game. I think she did play two with me some, and she was just like, that game is too hard. Which, to be fair, it probably was. I didn't think that worked. But I thought I would check. Oh, that doesn't work on him either, okay. Oh my god! Just a little bit of latency, man. 
God damn it. I thought I was gonna beat one without actually game overing. Your mom's playthrough of this last year was done in two hour blank, by the way. That's awesome! I'm glad that she, uh, oh yeah, hey, take that. Glad that she still plays. Does she stream? No! Oh, I fell backwards. I thought it was gonna fall the other way. Pro gamer. That's a pro gamer move. Pro gamer mom. I did it again, and then I ran off. Oh, my God. She did it on your stream, though. It was kind of a bet I had with her, so I had to cook for her. <laughs> That's awesome. Your stream is much better than mine. Everyone go follow Kaiser. Stop watching this. Kaiser, you go stream. And I'm just gonna go lay down. I obviously have no place here. Fucking died again. Do you like video game? Well, do I have an opportunity for you? Hey, Super Jump, how's it going? I just gotta polish up the graphics on level 3. Asking if someone's mom's streams can be taken in so many ways. It can. But we're all being wholesome here. Oh my god, this fucking... This delay, I'm like... Ju jumping at the very end of my jump. And it's just a mixed bag on whether or not I'm going to make it past. Fuck that. I'm not doing that shit again. I'd like to stay here, yes, with you, yes, gamer boy. Why do I jump down there right away? I'm gonna hurry. No. On the plus side, I get all my powers back. Going pretty all right here. How about ye? Uh, are you done with that level? We have other video games for you to finish. <laughs> um, do a slide jump next time? Yeah, see, I'm having, I'm having a hard time with that, too. Like, it... It... See, like, it seems like I get stuck into doing the slide all the way through, and I, I can only jump at the very end. I'm doing all right, all things considered. All right, the little babies. Hello, extra. Oh, underwater you can jump out of slides? I did not know that, and that's also very stupid. can't jump out of slides. Why, why would it be different?
Don't kill the babies. I already killed them. I went back to kill them. Oh my, wait, is this, are you fucking kidding me? I can't, oh my god. I have an idea. So this is the one game where you don't fall off of the, oh my god, they're gonna kill me. You don't fall off of the ladder when you switch weapons when you unpause. I don't know, you also can't jump out of slides under places with ladders, it's dumb. <laughs> I just wanted to try something out and I'm dying for it. Really? Fuck you! How about that? How about a big fuck you? Just wanted to see if this would. Nope. Wow. Star Crash is a bad shield. I'll say it. What's the best shield ability in Mega Man? I can't believe you don't fall off the ladders in this game. So weird. It's ladders 101. There's a use for Power Stone here. Stand the ladder and mash B. Yeah, that would have been good if I had seen that before I killed <laughs> Oh, God. Ooh, I barely made that. I'll use it on this one, though. Fuck him. I really am just shocked that you don't fall off of ladders. This is the f Is this the first game that does that? It's not even very strong! Look at this! I'm d he took a charge shot and then like six stones. This thing is kind of familiar. Oh, okay. The platforms only move when I'm standing on them? Always go left. Nope. Just whatever side you're on.
the last clip, which is the big one. But only after. Oh, right. I could avoid so many deaths if I didn't hoard E-Tanks. I think Mega Man 7 turned me into a, a dirty E-Tank hoarder. I don't know why that guy's there. Should I, should I try the skip and then I guess I can rewind. Let's check it out. position fire another arrow and jump over it walking toward the wall so you have to slide too Jesus Feels e tank, man. Napalm man, you're not weak to wave, you're weak to something stupid. Say all you need if you want to try it. Yeah, let's give it a shot. I just gotta make sure I get the exact uh, ladder position just to be just to be safe. Okay. Everything looks right. Just rewind. God, they go so fast. I get so, some, it's in some ways harder doing it with the, uh, the rewind. <laughs> no! Slide into the arrow. Oh. Uh, block of grass. Shoot an arrow. Tap down. Shoot again. Then run to the. Then run. Shoot again. Then run to them and stand on the top one. And left when Mega Man. And left and then when Mega Man moves, hold right. Doesn't the video have? Bad Dio skip. 
try this as explained above much easier, okay? Oh, whoa. I'm not sure how much I care to even do this. <laughs> I'm just going to keep trying it this way because uh, at least... Oh, no, I can't rewind far enough now. find the fucking positioning. I'm trying your setup. I thought. I thought that's what the YouTube video was. No? The other one's your video. Okay, so... specific rung. Shoot one. No? This is not the right rung? Tap down once. I, I don't understand. Yes, I'm watching the video. Didn't seem to work. This is why I don't speed run. I mean, I just, I don't, <laughs> I don't think I care. Am I supposed to slide away? Like, I don't know what exactly I'm supposed to be doing. I get that I'm supposed to be on this rung, and I shoot one, and then I shoot another one. One after I've tap tapped down, and then I get on them, and then I slide. But nothing else is explained here. Shoot one, tap down, shoot the other one. Get on them, and then slide, and you go through the wall. I don't know if this doesn't work on... Turbo, I don't know if this, like, I don't know if I'm sp which way I'm supposed to slide. Yeah, no. Don't seem to be getting it. After you set the arrows there, you need to slide away, then in again. So I, after I get on the arrows, I slide away on top of them, and then slide in on top of them. Is this setup even correct? I don't know. And there's like a 20 second delay between when you're gonna see this and when. I'm getting good arrow setups. setup you're doing is one frame. Lining up with the top of the broken glass. After you set the arrows there, you need to slide away, then in again. 
So if I'm if I'm to assume this, God, if I'm assumed to that the arrow setup is good, then I'm just not getting the timing down. Now I have to rewind because I didn't hit the home button because I'm a dummy. this again I slide away from them and then into them I slide away from the wall and then into the wall or do I slide into the wall and then away from the wall The initial arrow setup is when Mega Man arm is on the ladder handle. That's the same height as the bottom of the broken glass. Then you tap down a little bit. Then you go on, slide out, out from the wall, and then in again. Fish, please just move on. I'm going to try it just a couple more times, and then I'm done. It's the last time I'll explain it. Refight isn't too bad anyways. Yeah, I, I appreciate trying. Uh, and you're trying to explain it to me. I just don't think I have the... I have the patience or that I... I care to do it myself. Like I said, I'm not... I'm not really into speedrunning. And I'm not into, uh... Breaking the game to skip parts of it. Myself. I... I... Okay, slide... no. Slide away and then in. Not like that. It's like I can't even get... I Like, it's just... It's not working. Don't slide in again before you see Mega Man clip. Oh, I, I never saw him clip. So I will just be impressed that you did it and... Uh, move on. Ability sucks. Oh well, you saw it, so it's okay. Yeah, it looks it's it's a cool skip that would save so much time. Like holy crap! Let's go. <laughs> Thank you for showing me. Sorry, I got I got frustrated. Just. Not really something I wanted to do. Starman is weak to... don't know. Oh, water wave. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh my god. Are you fucking kidding me? How did that not hit him? Sorry, Chapman. Oh, no, it's it's all good. Maybe someday I will try to speedrun Mega Man 5. I doubt it, but you never know. Fuck. If I do, I know who to go to now. Oh, 
Oh, I'm on my last life. Let's just use these so we don't have to do this shit again. <laughs> He's weak to what? Gravity hold, I think? Epic gamer moment. <laughs> Stone Man is weak to Napalm? I can't believe that he is not. He does not actually shake the ground when he does that. will be uh, Gravity Man. Excuse me. Just, I think that with my uh, my few milliseconds of delay too, that might have just been exacerbating the uh, the issue with that glitch. I just totally looked away and then I just didn't even see that. Oh my god. I don't like that. Like, the skull has, like, tusks coming out of it. Oh my god. Hang on. Why can you chase me beyond the edge of the screen? Oh my god! What the fuck? Why are they storing the memories from so far away, but then they respawn every fucking time? I'm just going. Fuck you. I have 10 million E-Tanks I can use if I need them. Is there another one up here? Please! Stop! God! <laughs> My 
my shot disappeared. Oh my god. Get him beat. Yeah. Get him. Beats wildin' out. <laughs> He's right there. <laughs> Beat hit him. Oh, my God. I see. Just standing still seems to work best. Time for a stupid bird. <laughs> okay. His AI always confused me when I played this before. So now that you explained it a little bit better, I kinda get kinda get what he's thinking. Get him! Fuck you! Me and my robot bird that's my helmet. Pushing, shoot, but nothing's happening. Come on, beat. He did it. <laughs> Dr. Light, stop. Aren't... Oh... Oh my god, Protobin's sprite sliding out of frame is hilarious here to me for some reason. <laughs> Yay, we did it! Two hours, 20 minutes-ish. So yeah, playing all of them in one run would be, uh, not great. I thought about doing one through three. Man, just, I don't know. I like Mega Man games a whole lot. I, I love them, but, like, they can be so, they, they're so easily frustrating. I think that if I had, like, uh, a latency-free input, it would be a different story, and I would consider doing, I would consider doing all six of them in one run, but... Man, just the fact that any little tiny thing, and like my reluctance to rewind, which is uh, solidified more by people in chat giving me shit every time that I do it, um, like, just makes it unnecessarily difficult for games that I've already beaten, you know, at least a dozen times. So, I just, I do not think it would be a fun stream, <laughs> especially starting with one. Ugh. I dislike one intensely. But I do like this one. It didn't hold up quite how I remembered it. I think I, the first time I played it, I just remember being so dreadfully bored with 4 comparatively that when 5 had all these new ideas and like changes, I was like, oh, sweet. And it was so much easier um, lives-wise. Like, I feel like every time you have to continue, it's a bad sign. But this game hands out lives like candy. Um... So, I mean, that, that helps the difficulty a lot, too. And I, I really just like all the different things that it adds in. Like the, uh, 
the skidoo stage, um, the gravity stage, the castle that you shoot down around you, um, the boss where you have to platform off of it. Like, that kind of stuff hasn't really been done that much. One is fun, though. I, I do not like one very much. It's, it's near the bottom of my list. What's your, what's your order, Kaiser? If you had to order all of the Mega Man games from favorite to least favorite. Because mine would be two, nine, three, five, six, and then four and ten. I don't remember ten well enough, but four, I'm just not crazy about. So those would probably be about equal. Uh, I might put eight above one. I liked eight from what I remember of it. But I also just intensely hated 7, so liking 8 could partially be from um, my intense uh, distaste for 7 and moving on to 8 right after. Classic only? Okay. Yeah, it's a lot. It's hard. There's, there's so many of them. Is this one of the games that just can't do anything after the credits? Um, oh, and then 11. I keep forgetting it about 11. Which is bad because it came out like last year and it, it should have been a bigger deal but it's just it's fine all right let's look at some of these some of these enemies apache joe erucan Toper away. Come on. Giri. Graviton. Uh, Crystal Joe. I like those guys. Cowker Q. Coco. Not Coco. Jet Bomb. New Shield Attacker. Susie G. Space Metal. Subail. Sumatran. Taban, Daidine, Dachon, or Dacone? Uh, Tate Pakan, Twin Cannon, Tekyun, Toss Machine. Okay, so it originally was a pitching machine, that's cute. Tone Dial, Nobita, Bounder, Power Muscler, Be bitter. Herarian. V. Fujin. Puka Pucker. Best 5, 3, 2, 7. You have 7 that high, really. Man, I detest 7. I do not look forward to playing it in a couple months. 4, 10, 1. RMF. Rockman. Football? Uh, 11, 8, 9, and 6. You really? 6 and 9 and. Ha, 6 and 9 are at the bottom of your list. That's interesting because I, I really I really like 9. I just think it's way too hard. Um, and I like 6 a lot too. I think 6 has really good music and really interesting color palettes and uh, the power ups are cool. Rockman and Forte. Gotcha. I don't know why I didn't think of that. Rockman and Forte I would put at the bottom, but I... That's the one I have not finished, because all I had access to was the Game Boy Advance version, which is garbage. Uh, that's also way too hard. Rockman and Forte above 9. I don't, I don't think I'm ever going to understand you. Puka Pelly. Uh, Bomb Throne. Bomb Beer. Mousubile, Missile, Metal K1000, Metal Cannon, Metal Mommy, aww, Yudon, Ryder Joe, Rounder, Lyric, Rumbacoon, 
Rolling drill. I like how there's not even art for this thing. It's just the sprite from the game. Yeah, why don't you like nine? Rock throne. Dark man one. Made to assassinate Mega Man. It's based on Dark Man 2's design. How does that fucking work? Dark Man 3. Big Pets. Circling Q9. Or wait, no. Circling Q9. Wily Press. Wily Machine 5. Wily Capsule 2. 9 is like 4, but worse. Great names. In what way is 9 like 4? Wave Man. Stone Man. Gyro Man. Oh, his feet are crazy. Star Man. I love Star Man's design. And his little star arm cannon. Star cannon. Charge Man. Charge Man's got its fucking shit-ass design, though. <laughs> Napalm Man. Crystal Man. And we're back to Apache Joe. In what way? Turn down the music on my end too, Jesus. Star Man is a crystal gem. Crystal Man would be a crystal gem. I think it's the stages. No sliding and buster weapons. I mean, yeah, it's... I mean, but 4 has sliding. And the buster. It's more like 2. And I think that 9 has the best balanced weapons out of the entire series. I think that no other game is every weapon, like, useful for both casual and experienced play. Star Motif, though. That's true. If they fuse, they would be a crystal gem. Just my personal opinion, but don't get me wrong, I still play them all. Yeah, apparently. I'm, I, was, I was interested to see you put Rockman and Forte in there, so much so that I just completely forgot that it existed. I fucking hate that game. The Game Boy Advance version is fucking terrible. And I'm not convinced the Super Famicom version is much better, but I've never played it. And cause it's just, it's way too hard. I, I would also like to see them, I'd like to order them by difficulty too at some point, because I would put, I would put seven and Seven at the highest, but I would put Rockman and Forte higher than that. Um, oh, look, at, look at this face. Look at this face. Dr. Wright. I imported it from Japan. It's ten times better than the Game Boy version. It's not hard. The Game Boy version is fucking terrible. It like it's it's so brutally hard, and the resolution sucks. And man, that should be an emote. That would be a cute emote. I need to make emotes too. I just I still I just if it's not a streaming day, I just have put very little effort into streaming lately. Prone man in the background, just like, be gone, bitch. <laughs> oh god, this box art. I like how they don't even have like the full, like a non-dented version of this. Gravity man with his weird design. Proto man in the background. Look at him. With a cape. The fuck does Proto Man have a cape and a scarf? V the vengeance of Proto Man. Happy boy. He's objectioning. Proto Man has gone berserk. Destroying half the city was not enough. Now he has snatched Dr. Light and is holding him and the entire city hostage. Speeding to the rescue is Mega Man and his modified Mega Buster, but eight of Proto Man's cybernetic soldiers plan to send Mega Man to the scrap heap for good. Feel the weight of the world on your shoulders as you battle Gravity Man. Ship away at the rock-like defenses of Stone Man and bring him crumbling down. Hit the surf and sail 
up against the tile power of Wave Man. They help Mega Man defeat all of eight, all eight of Proto Man's robots, and they get ready for the fight that pits brother against brother in the battle of the century. Proto Man's got Doctor Light, but Mega Man is. Proto Man's got Doctor Light, but Mega Man is back, ready to put some heavy pedal to the metal to defeat Stone Man, Gyro Man, Star Man, Wave Man, Charge Man, and other robotic goons. Use his Mega Buster and Super Arrow to make it to the castle and keep and and put Proto Man on the scrap heap forever. Maybe. Oh my God, the baby metal! Uh, look at look at Beat's stupid face. Hey guys, <laughs> hey. He had a cape from Mega Man 3. This description is libel. Proto Man was framed. He was. <laughs> I guess it's hard to show off the power of gravity. That's the baby you murdered. Do you feel good about yourself? I murdered several of those. This looks like a fancy Roomba. <laughs> this rush coil looks like a fucking, like, kitty ride. Oh, look at this art. This is much better. Mega Man doesn't look like a fucking deformed gremlin. I mean, everything else looks mostly the same, but his face is so much better. I'm a motherfucking star, man. Wave Man's got a cool design too. The harpoon, the fucking like snorkel tube to his mouth. That's cool. Gremlin Man. Put that in a museum. Uh, I love, I like Beat a lot. Beat Man, that's the thing, is Beat. In, in Smash 4, woof, that Gravity Man. In Smash 4, Beat was a. Uh, he was one of Mega Man's custom moves, and he could replace Rush uh, Coil as your recovery. And he was so good, because he could go so fucking high. You could recover from anything. And uh, I miss that. Because it was... What was the third one, though? It was Rush Coil, Beat, and... Was it like a Tornado move? I want to say it was from Mega Man 8. Is it Tengu Lift or something? Beat cute. It was something like that. I think it made like a... It was cool too. I think it made like a... Whoosh. Whoosh. An airstream that whooshed you up. And that was neat. But uh... Yeah, Beat was beat was the best. Because it just... It, you could recover from anything. Custom moves were so cool. They were. But they... I mean, I imagine they were so much extra work. That for... For... 90% or for most people to not care about them 99% of the time it just wasn't worth it especially if they were bringing back all of the characters and you know DLC oh he thick concept art's always pretty cool oh man that castle Yeah, Tengu Man. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I thought it was... I couldn't remember what it was for the longest time. And I was trying not to look it up. I was like, I know I'm going to remember. Because it was... Uh, Tengu Man beat Rush Coil for Up B. Neutral B was Metal Blade, Shadow Blade, or... Cut Man's attack? What the hell is that called? Rolling Cutter? 
side B was Crash Bomb, or, ah, shit, the hell's it called? I think it's also from 8, Burst Bubble, it's the one that lives, I want to live in Proto Castle, it's the one that lifts up and then explodes, uh, Crash Bomb, Burst Bubble, or, I don't remember, and down B was Leaf Shield, uh, Skull Barrier, or Plant Barrier, or Plant Shield, whatever it's called. And I never really understood what the point of Plant Barrier was. But I will say that it shouldn't have been Skull Barrier that reflected, because Skull Barrier doesn't reflect shit. It should have been Jewel Satellite, because Jewel Satellite actually does reflect stuff. Anyway, this is a good art. Uh, it's got... What, all the masters from one through five and it has the Mega Man killers and reggae does it have a uh, tango in it though so the Mega Man killers you got anchor you got I don't think I can zoom out with the NES controller you got uh what's his maybe it only has anchor I could have sworn I saw somebody else or well, there's reggae the bird Maybe just anchor. I guess so. I don't see any purple blade. I don't see punk. Yeah, that's this is a cute art. It's got <laughs> Mecha Dragon with Iceman just in his mouth. Iron Man. Yeah, this is cute. This is where Inafune's art shines, I think. Dragon eaten Iceman popsicle. Dragon's tail. Oh yeah, no, yeah, there he is. I, I could I was like I could have sworn I saw punk right there. Punk in here somewhere. Now Belade is not in here though, right? I don't see any any purple other than the Mecha Walker and Napalm man. But they could have just miscolored him. Yeah, no, I don't think he's here. Yeah, that's Punk. Punk. Oh, no, I yeah, Quint is who I saw back here. I was like, I knew I saw somebody else, I just couldn't remember who. Weird. Yeah, fan club poster. Cute. Yeah, so, uh, later this month I will play Mega Man 6, or if my past history is any <laughs> indication uh, at the very beginning of July and then we'll get to move over to Anniversary Collection 2 or Legacy Co whatever Legacy Collection 2 so I can play even Quint LMAO so I can play uh, my least favorite Mega Man 7 I'm a fan but uh, yeah thanks for uh, thanks for joining thanks for chatting Thanks for uh, thanks for all the the tips, Kaiser. I appreciate it. Um, if anyone's watching and hasn't followed, feel free to give me a follow so you can see when I stream again. I am gonna stream tomorrow. Um, more Mario and Sonic at the Tokyo 2020 Olympic Games um, with the redubbing. I'm not sure who all is gonna be able to join that, but hopefully it is the last stream of that game because that campaign is way too long when you're revoicing all of the characters. Uh, later, Paper Sonic, thanks for joining. Or later, JoJo, thanks for joining. So yeah, I will stream that tomorrow if everything goes well. And we're, re we're revoicing the entire storyline. So that's been a lot of fun. Um, probably the most fun I've had streaming pretty much all together, I think. Yeah, see you, Kaiser. Um, if you'd like to, I've also been putting the VODs onto YouTube. We have a link to the YouTube channel down below. I think it's over over there somewhere. Um, you can check those out. Check out the YouTube channel. See all the past games I've played. I'm working on um, compiling all the April Fool's videos together because I'm that far behind on that. Just so I can put them into one because they were all split up. So I can't just do the regular Twitch export. Um, it's also the Discord group. We have a pretty bustling community in there going. We get a, at least a few messages per day, I feel like. Um, you also can go to the Facebook group. 
Um, I update when I'm streaming on Facebook, Twitch, and Facebook, Discord, and Twitter. Uh, but in Discord, yeah, we have a nice community. You can talk about games, talk about toys, talk about what's going on. We have a big Animal Crossing. Seems like most people just talk about Animal Crossing. But uh, So there's that too. But I am going to go so I don't get burnt out on streaming since I'm going to do it for at least a couple more hours tomorrow. And I will catch you all hopefully tomorrow. And if not, I'll catch you whenever I see you next. Thanks for uh, hanging out. Thanks for chatting. And everyone have a good night. Let's see if there's anyone to... Uh, Anyone to raid? I think Cass might still be streaming. Lay bye. See you, Super Jump. Let's see. Oh, man, I hope I can. Yes. Let's raid Cass. I totally remember how to do this. Host raid. All right, guys, we're gonna raid Cass, and uh, he's playing. He's playing some weird fucking game, Library of Ruina. I have no fucking idea. It's a sequ sequel to Lobotomy Corporation, which he was really into. It looks cool. He's always entertaining, though, so go give him some love, and uh, I'll catch you all tomorrow or later. Stay safe. Um, you know, give to uh, give to Black Lives Matter support where you can. You know, give the support that you can to that those causes. Um, stay safe in multiple different ways. And uh, I'll talk to you later.
way, I don't think I need to make this loop for this setup to work. <laughs> they just kind of die anyways. 